What? But... <clears throat> oh. Hey. I'm sorry I spiked you, okay? I just, I get so mad and I can't control things and then, you know, shit just falls on top of me. My life sucks right now and I don't know what to do except I want to say I love you and hug it out, but all that wimpy shit is just... Well, I'd say gay, but I have some friends who are gay, so that's not cool anymore. And the ones that I don't really like, it's not because they're gay. So, lame, all right? You are just a lame and angry psycho sometimes. You do bad shit and things. I don't know if I love you, and I'm pretty sure I hate you a little bit, but I'm just so fucking upset that we can't even see each other. And you're just a drunk, lame dad. You know what? That might just be the nicest thing anybody's ever said to me. So will you buy me a car? What? I mean, not in the so will you buy me a car kind of way, in a completely off topic, can you buy me a car? I mean, firstly, I'm a, a fat shit that you ruined. And, and secondly, I will get a job and I will stop smoking pot in that sort of way, okay? I love you too, son. Now, go, get a job. Cause I don't have the money to buy you a car. Besides which way, I'm probably gonna be dead in a couple weeks anyway. Please don't die, okay? Yeah, it's great catching up with you two, Dad. Yeah. Hey, uh, how's your mother? Oh, she's great. <sighs> no, she's not. She's bored. I mean, all this mesmerizing, tantric sex she's been having with a much younger, better-built, caring and compassionate man is great and all, but what's she gonna do for the other six hours of the day? What the fuck? I I'm just winding you up, you miserable bastard. She's mad at you. She's scared that you're gonna die, and she wants you to go over there and prove that you give a fuck. All right, all right, all right! I can take a fucking hint. Let's go. We'll get Tracy on the way. Tracy, on the other hand, she's a star, sort of. Mom said she was at Bean Machine. So, what's been happening? You know, uh, I don't know, s stuff? No, I don't know. Well, what's been happening with you? Uh, thanks. It's been... it's... It's anyone's guess. Yeah. Yeah, I get it. There they are, outside. Lost car, Caffeine. Come on. Your curling has been sluggish for weeks. A little bit less lifestyle guru and a little... Uh, excuse me, I'm trying to write a screen... Shush, here. woman! Hey, Amanda. Fabian. Michael? Hi, Mom. Hi, Jimmy. This is too a picture of holistic well-being, I don't think. Hey. Maybe they shit once a year between them. Hey, oh! That's my son! Amanda, come. I have a new unit out on hold. You must pay for it. Hey! Hey! Buddy, I'm gonna ask politely that you show my wife a little respect. Red meat has been blocking your chi as well as your digestive tract. I ain't even gonna go there. I'm gonna ask you one time, nicely. Michael, just... Hit him, please. Shush, woman! Anything for you, sweetheart. What, what are you doing? Uh, uh, I had some really good work there, you dick! There's a lot more where that came from, Holmes. <laughs> Is he alive? <laughs> yeah, he's fine. Listen, Amanda. I wanted... I'm meaning to say to you, look, I just... What he's trying to say, Mom, is that he's a pathetic, old, drunken mess, and he needs you. And you could do a lot better than a prima donna yoga instructor with an anal fixation. Someone say- Shut up! I guess we could try. All I'm asking for is a shot. Neutral ground. Dr. Friedlander's office. It's perfect. All of us. I'll pick up Tracy and bring her there. Meet you? Fine. All right, you. Come on. Get up, you idiot. Uh, yoga? No. No yoga. Uh, I, I... All right. You know where your sister is, right? Yeah. Let's go. Wait, wait, wait. But what about that sugar, caffeine, and emulsified pig fat flavored beverage I want? Another time. Oh. 
Come on, I won't want to. Later. I think Tracy's over at the tattoo parlor. What? Tracy's getting another tattoo? No, oh god no. That Laszlo guy's there. Laszlo? That asshole? What's he want? It's Tracy that wants something. She wants to get back on fame or shame after you and Uncle T cut her cameo short. Well, maybe we ought to help her out with that. Maybe we ought to. Hey, let me ask you. Back there with your mom. That went okay, didn't it? Anything that ends with Fabian's burst eardrum is more than okay with me. Yeah, I mean with me and your mom. Me and your mom. I think it's an important first step in, like, the direction of okay, if you know what I mean. Uh, I think they're in here. Fucked up. Asshole! What the hell? I'm looking for something hip that, you know, says I'm capable of violence, but I'm awesome in the sack. So listen, babe, if you want to make it in Vinewood, you got to do whatever it takes, even if <laughs> whatever it takes is a depressed borderline alcoholic who hosts the third most popular talent show amongst the 40-year-old female demographic. So you'll let me on the show if I blow you? Uh, yes, and if you could wear some black lipstick, the little guy loves the goth vibe. Oh, oh whoa, Laszlo. <laughs> Dude, that was entirely out of context, bro. Jim, you find the ink slinger, sit on him. Laszlo here is gonna have a little cosmetic work done. No, please. Whoa, 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 whoa. stay put, you lame-ass Mark. Uh, sure, kid. What? Just oh, uh, uh, now. Oh, are you popping a fucking tent over here? Are you fucking psycho! Ah, oh, you fucking prick! Jesus! Come on! Ah! Ow! Oh, oh, that looks pretty. Here, let's get rid of this. Oh my God! Papa Bear, what's Daddy Number Two gonna? Th Think about this! Uh, let's not get him involved. Uh, let's do... Uh, just just to be clear, I'm not paying for this, right? Mm. Uh, you butcher! I, uh, uh, please don't tattoo a cock! Uh, How about I throw all those three little pubic hairs on here, too? Uh, uh, there we go. Oh, nice. Uh, you got like a camera phone or a mirror? I can. Oh yeah, I'll get you a mirror. Smash uh, you over the head with it. Oh, too nice fuck this. Oh, oh, ah. Ah. Snip, snip. Oh, this is a real one-stop shop. What are you doing? Oh, oh no, that's my, that's my signature, my ponytail. Now I gotta get extensions. No, what you gotta get is my daughter, whatever she wants. Yeah, without sucking on your piddle stick. Look, okay guys, that was a joke. I'm a clown, I'm a sad, lonely little clown. Hey, you're gonna put her on your show and you're gonna make sure she looks good. Look, okay, I got a lot of juice in this town, but I mean, I'm not a miracle. Just do it! Uh, yeah. All right. All right, Trace, let's go. We gotta get to the therapist. What? So, I'll like call you or something, okay? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Ever a family that needs therapy? <laughs> My pony. How do I look? It's not good, is it? Who knew you could use a tattoo gun? It's one of those skills you pick up in prison. You know, inking your name on your celly's ass. Ew! Are you serious? Come on! No! Not quite. Not to be difficult, but your therapist hasn't exactly been transformational to your mental health. So I don't know why he'd be better positioned to help for dysfunctionals. Hey, this was your mother's idea. Well, I guess it beats yoga. Huh? Now he beats yoga. Drive carefully! He beats yoga. Literally. Like Fabian? Around the head with a laptop? Oh yeah, like, pow! Our old man released the dude's inner tranquility all over the bean machine badium. To be honest, and I know it's karmically bad, but yeah, I fucking hate that dude. Yeah, I know, right? He's so up his own ass. You're a fucking contortionist. Whoopee. I contort my junk all day long and I don't act all superior about it. Just a little ashamed and empty inside. Overshare. Hey, guy was talking smack to your mother. Well, I applaud you, Pop. Here, here. You're like finally like using your powers of selfishness and rage for like good. Not an objective universal good, but like a subjective what's in our best interest kind of good. 
Fuck yeah! Awesome! Let's rob somebody! Ha. Do it, Dad! Yeah! Do, do it. it! Do, do it. it! Enough! Okay? I love that we're getting along, but knock it off! Yeah, don't, like, actually rob a liquor store. That might, like, kill the mood. Fucking therapy. Let's do that shit. Hey, how about you just let your mom and me talk, okay? We got some issues we gotta iron out. And seeing as you two aren't into it, you can just sit there and be quiet. That's cool with me. I got all the prescriptions I need, at, at least for the meantime. Thank you. Michael, kids, let's go inside. Okay. I'm fighting. Amanda! Hello! Good to see you again. Michael, I'm so glad. Isn't this great? Fantastic. Michael, be positive. I am being positive. <clears throat> this is me being positive. Give it up, Michael. The sarcasm. It's one of the reasons I moved out. It's beneath you. No, it's not, Amanda. Trust me. Nothing's beneath me. No, normally there's a whore beneath you. <laughs> you know, for someone who spends every waking moment working on themselves inside and out, I gotta tell you, the progress has been really fucking slow. How would you know what progress is like, you stupid murdering shit? Uh, gee, because all you do is whine at me. Oh! All I do is whine. Michael, could you please stop murdering people? Michael, could you please stop endangering me and the both of your children? You kill people and then you sit in the sun and drink and feel guilty about it. That is not work. I don't see you complaining on the way to the fucking bank. I mean, let's face it, Amanda. We're trailer trash, you and me. We were taught to do this. Get a center, Michael. You have no center. How about you suck my cock? Huh? No way. We'll both get a center before that ever happens. You are such a fucking animal, a deranged animal. You're fucking ain't right, I'm deranged. How could I not be? I should have had you locked up years ago, you stupid Do shit. It. Do it. I'll put you in the fucking ground with the rest of them. And that's really all the time we have. Oh. Great. I think we made some real progress there. Oh, uh, Michael. <laughs> I hope this goes without saying, but family work is a little more expensive. What, double? Squared. <laughs> of course. Take care now. Hey, so you gonna come home with me or what? Guess we'll give it a try. All right then. Kids! So, will you drive us home? You know, there was a moment there, I thought... What? I don't know, like, maybe we still had a ways to go, you know, like, maybe we need more time. Time for what? Time to move beyond screaming at each other. That was cathartic. Catharsis all over my face. Ooh, I got a warm, fuzzy feeling. Probably just the meds you raided. Okay. Cathartic. All right, I just don't want it to be more of the same. Now you're the one making the demands? No, 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 not demands. I, I, I'm saying you're right. Something was broke, and we gotta work at fixing it. We do, all of us. Yes, Mom. For real, peeps. Because I started to understand something in there. No one else gets this family. Not Dr. Friedlander, or my yoga teacher, or our tennis coach, or the juice guy, or the dog walker. Oh, or... hey, hey. Oh. Or Jimmy's third grade teacher. Or the trash guy. Or dad's proctologist. Or the guy that thinks he's Jesus on Vespucci Beach. Or the hippie bum who thinks the world is ending. We're stuck with each other. I mean, how do you explain faking our deaths, changing our names, all the lying to the FIB? That monster, Trevor. Kids, rooms. If you find dead bodies, cheap women, or Trevor Phillips, we're checking into the Rockford Hills Hotel.
morning after the night before. <laughs> Ooh. Hey, Mike. It's Franklin, man. I'm following the architect. All right. Don't fuck it up. All right. Hey, stupid! You can't be on here without a hat! Yeah, thanks a lot. Site inspection! Architect on... to a buck. I do, homie. Here. Thank you. So, all good? Sure, homie. So is this shit for real? We just gonna rob the FIB and be allowed to walk by your boys like that? Yeah, I don't fucking know. Probably not. All right, Lester, what do you got? Uh, I don't quite know yet. Give me a minute. I'm not a fucking computer. Oh. Oh. Oh, maybe I am. <laughs> Here's what I think. We have two options. The new security software goes into containment mode in case of emergency, you know, uh, earthquakes, mudslides, acts of God. So we could plant some firebombs. They go bang, the emergency call goes out. We hijack it, show up as firemen, and then we grab the containment drive. Or we could hack the system on site. We'll go in by, uh, by air. Uh, hope we don't run into too much physical resistance. Sounds relaxing. Either bombing our office ran by a division of corrupt government psychos or defeating one of the world's most complex security systems using our worthless ass ninja skills, huh? Yeah, any, many, money, mo. If you favor the firebomb containment drive, it'll. Yeah. Now, Haynes has given us the leftover money. Of course. Now, you'll need. Ah, my lucky charm from. I don't know how. He's my go-to guy. They did good Evangelico, remember? Okay. That all look good to you? You are robbing the FIB here. 
And we have a winner. I'll make the arrangements and call you when we're ready. All right, shit, hit me. You know, um, I'm still looking into that Union Depository gig. It's real interesting. But I don't know if we can do it without you-know-who. Uh, well, as long as he can't do it without us. Okay. Ah, hello, my friend. Hey, what are you looking so cool, calm, and collected for? I guess because I'm not the one who's about to die based on some inappropriate decision I made a long time ago. Ah, thanks for the moral support. I appreciate it. What the fuck ever happened to burying the past, huh? Any fool should be able to turn over a new leaf, right? Well, first, your new leaves aren't so very different from your previous leaves. It seems like they fell from a pretty similar tree. Second, the age of the internet, my Ludite friend. Nothing is forgotten. There are no new leaves. Everything you do and don't do is recorded forever and used to beat you. This is the age of Judgment Day every day. And in the revelation of that, I'd say that you got off pretty lightly. What with all the, uh, the murders and the, and, and the thefts and... All right. This straight talk and new, uh... Tell it like it is reality guy act. Uh -huh. It ain't working so well for me. In that case, um, don't worry about it. Everything is fine. You're a good man and a great father, really. It's more like it. Hey, what's up, y'all? Hey. So what y'all talking about? The internet age. <laughs> the internet age? Oh, yeah. Man, ain't we got a hotly defended federal building to fucking rob? Yes, we do. Let's get after it. I'm gonna miss this place. If we're gonna do this thing and maybe take that score, well, I, I guess this has all got to be gone. All right, with the sad goodbyes. Agent Steve set up a base of operations at the Noose Building off the Palomino Freeway. All right, now let's roll on this thing. Why are you so chipper? Shit, why are you so miserable? Must be an age thing. Great. Now there's something to look forward to. What's the plan again, man? And please, let it involve someone shooting you for being so goddamn miserable. Oh, what is this? Pick on me day? Look, I know I'm a miserable old prick, but give me a break. You and Lester. Shit! So the plan was feeling sorry for your ass, right? I miss Lester saying that shit, for sure. Let's feel sorry for Michael. Rich. White Michael. Poor Michael, who robbed banks for ten years, then got his slate wiped clean. Yeah, yeah. Poor Michaels, whose homies get into shit with the FIB out of the kindness of their own heart. Put they necks on the line. Man, where's my get-out-of-jail-free car, motherfucker? I'm sorry, okay? You know what, Mike? You a real easy dude to identify with, man. Poor me. Pour me. Man, pour me a drink, nigga. Okay. Okay. I can see. Maybe I've been a little caught up in myself lately. A little? 
Hey, just give me the plan, okay? All right. Here's the shot. We're taking a chopper up to altitude, jumping out, and climbing in through the Bureau skylight. We hit the computer system. That might take a while, so we gotta hold off any resistance. Once we're in the system, we download the files, chopper picks us up. Hey, that was real simple, wasn't it? I'm informed now, dawg. The place is up here. Chopper pilot, gunman, driver, and hacker should be waiting. I'll radio in. Guys, are we ready? Waiting on you. This place is with the creeps, Holmes. Same with the sled pilot. All right, I need IT outside the FIB building. Ready for the cyber part of this op. I'll be on standby, boss. All right, you're Haynes' pilot, right? We gotta wait until it's late enough, then we move in the chopper. You can take us up. I'll get on the stick when you jump. I'm going to take us up to the jump spot. Feels weird not having Trevor on the stick. Feels okay to me. He might be a better pilot, but I'm less inclined to kill you in your sleep. That ain't what he says. Okay, I'm less inclined to stab you in the face and then do funny things to your corpse. That sounds about right. Hey, everyone, quick pep talk. My friend Franklin here called me out for being an ungrateful prick on the way over here. I have to admit, I've been remiss. Everyone's being paid on this run except me. But it ain't great money for the crazy target you're drawing on your backs, and there's a good chance this thing won't work at all. I took the job. I knew it was gonna be like that. Hey, look down there. Lester was kidding, homie. He torched the joint. Yeah, it makes me think like he ain't got faith in his own crazy plan. So, in short, thank you for your efforts. It means a lot to me. Hey, come on. Grab the stick. You got it. You ready? Uh, are you? You fucking kidding me? I'm lucky I can even breathe at this altitude, let alone calculate the odds of surviving the jump. Landing, fucking firefighter, whatever else blowback there might be. All right, I shouldn't have had. Let's go. Come on, what the fuck you waiting for? We on. Come on. Okay. Come on, Franklin. Let's go, buddy. Got it. Great. <laughs> Better than an elevator. Ah, fuck. I'm in the building. Room sealed! Hold, hold while I gain access. Hey, here you go, dog. That's a nice weapon. The alarm's been tripped. Yeah, no shit. An explosion will tend to do that. I'm looking at the terminal. The programs are on your cell phone. Connected to the machine. Yeah, they better be. You need to access my computer. Your cell will show as an external device. Concentrate. You gotta find this terminal's IP in the network's view. Okay, connection established. Now, to take down the firewall, run BruteForce.exe. 
The program will expose each character of the password as it tries different encryptions. Okay, looks like we're in. Good work. Start down and out.exe, and I'll do the rest from here. Okay, people, we're rewriting history. Security team's been deployed. Hear that? We gotta hold them off while this thing completes its process. Hey, we will prepare for this. Let's take it. It's underway! We'll need that chopper ASAP! Get her over the building! Careless initiated. Fly by the building. Yo! Watch the left side! Hey, the dudes are through the door. Hey, chopper's here. The process ain't finished yet. Holding over the FIB HQ. Back up! Eyes up! Back up with goddamn me! Hey, we're taking fire from the left side of the roof! You don't need to die here! Right side of the roof! Look out! What's so special about your computer? Right side of the roof, look out! Come on. FIB Chopper, he's on to us! Bringing it down! I'm taking fire! I'm hit! I'm hit! Get it! Get it! Brown! No! Don't die for this shit, dog! The pilot signal is totally dead. Oh shit, man! Don't worry, we got a backup plan. Use the harnesses. Repel from a few floors down. Man, shit! They gassing us out! It's just a little smoke, people. Guys, you there? Yeah, go ahead. The helicopter crash caused extensive damage. Explosion went through a couple of floors. Sprinklers brought the fire under control, but be extremely careful. All right, got it. Hurry up. Go. Download complete. Get the device. About time. Got it. All right, people. Let's get the hell out of here. Coming through! Get on the f Weapons free! Following you! I got this door! Dude, bought it! Let's move! Hold on, I hear something in the stairwell. Opening! Here we go! On me! Hey, we got a problem up here. Sprinkler system. Can't see anything. Man, can I have to shut it off? I'm in the system. Okay. Shutting down fire suppression. Atta girl. Whatever we're paying you, you're worth it. You've got no options left. Ah! You in our way. Corrupt ass bitch. Let's go. He didn't make it. You sure, man? Cause he might be a... No, he didn't make it. Are you funny, huh, motherfucker? Now let's get the fuck out of here. No, too high. The wind will tie us in a knot. We gotta keep moving. Come on, let's go. Man, fuck! Oh! Let's get out of here! Hey, let's move! Holy oh, shit! It, <coughs> let's go! Oh, moving! Moving! This way! Hands in the air. You gotta go, Ben! Let's go! Following you! Drop your shit up! You're getting out of here! Stay with me! We have a you gonna step to me? Push, people! Let's get out of here! We got what we came for! Come on! 
Come on, come on. We low enough? Yeah, this will do. Set up the rigs. All right, come on. What's going on on the outside? Ground units, air units, every unit in the state is on the way. I don't know if you have the firepower to hold them off. ETA is any minute. Well, then we better get gone before they show up. Let's get the fuck out of here, then. Okay, let's blow this joint. Over to the right, dog. Man, it's about every cop in L.S. County on the way. It don't look like they're for us. Not yet, at least. An air unit CD on the side of the building. Look out, guys. Ah, crap! They got a bird! Go! Go! Move with that thing up there! Public sector assholes! Alright, he's out! Fix the rope there! And we can get down to the street! That's it! Gotta go! No shit! Let's get cracking, man! Unless you're feeling at home in this fair building! Hey! You wanna say with Trevor? Feel free! Man, I was just fucking with you, dawg! Let's do this shit! Driver meant to be around front. Man, we going. Back down, assholes. Run or get clapped. Get out of the way. Ah, crap. Where's our driver? Hey, I'm here. Oh, shit, it's the ambulance. Get in. In, in, before they see us. Don't discharge your weapons. We want them to think we're a legitimate paramedic crew. Woo! This might just be working. All right, all right, we're clear. Frank, I told Les we could use your place for a post-mortem. Hey, that was a good call on the ambulance, Eddie. I saw what was going on in the Bureau, man. I wasn't gonna drive up in something obvious. That's the thinking we pay you to do. Whoa, now we're clear, I can probably say I never expected to make it out of there. Yeah, sure, man. We had it covered. Oh, really? It was covered, was it? Uh, yeah. Lester had the plan. It was all set up. Yeah, we had a plan. Hold off the nastiest team of crooked FIB agents in the country while the last of the baby boomers pretends he's a hacker? Come on, it was hopeful. And then when the chopper crashed? Oh, man, I thought there was no fucking way. Why do you think Lester burned down the business? Hell, why do you think I'm doing it for nothing? And these clowns are getting paid? My cuts go into the kids' college fund, if that's any consolation. A couple more scores, they're taken care of. And I can think about getting out of the game. Eddie, the place is up here. Can you ditch the vehicle and drop this guy where he wants to go? I'll take care of it. Hey, come on. Damn, Franklin. Oh, Jesus. Ah. Any longer and I was going to torch this place, too. <laughs> hey, hey, you did it! We did it! Yeah! yeah. Fucking it! <laughs> hey, where's my liquor at, dog? I got it. It's right here. Let's go, let's go. Come on. Here it is. Come here. Shit. There you go. Man, you may be a conflicting, hypocritical, self-loafing old bastard, dog, but there's no one else. I'd rather rob a federal building with me. Amen <laughs> to that. Thank you, boys. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> <sighs> so, you want another drink? I think I better stay at least a little bit sober. I gotta deal with Davy and Dickwad yet. Put things to bed. Man, you want me to roll with you, dog? No, no, I probably better do this alone. I mean, we did everything. We're all in this together, right? So as long as... We all are not together. There's nothing they can really do to us. All right, see you, dog. Take care. Then it's Trevor, and I'm out. Oh, we're gonna need Trevor. Maybe you should give him a call now. Oh, fuck that. After I take care of this shit. All right, all right, well, take care of yourself. Frankie! 
Lester. Lester needs a drink. Forgive me, sweetheart. We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm out, Davey. From now on, done. I appreciate that. I'm trying my best for you, but, but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather? Repeatedly? It doesn't help. That's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. They've been sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck! Hey, Sugar Plum. Daddy! I'm in trouble. What is it? Money? Drugs? Your mother. There's this guy. He's been following me around. I think he's about to do something. Yeah, yeah, I'm kind of busy right now. Fine! I'll call someone who can help! You'll be fine. 